Hi right, everyone. We're back out at the uh, lowdown patch. Gonna uh, do a little bit of lemon here and some a uh, couple little uh, just firewood cutting techniques. So yeah, got the 350 and the 372 X torque today. So we'll give them a run. We'll do a little bit of lemon first. Get some limbs out of the way. Hope you're all having an awesome day. So as you can see, this tree from right there, from right there, is off the ground all the way full length, right? 
Okay, so we're gonna talk about compression and tension on a cut such as this. Okay, so this right here, this underside, because this tree is off the ground, clear from up there, this is the compressed side on this log. This is compressed, this is tension on top. So we wanna clip this, come up around, and then cut from the top down, and it'll fall. Now, as you can see, this, my channel is a firewood, you know, I, I cut firewood. It's no high balling, uh, you know, it's no high balling logging show. So when I'm cutting firewood, I don't mind if it breaks a little bit, you know, I don't, I don't mind if it cracks a little bit, but I don't want that big flap. If I just cut this off with all this weight out here, if I cut this off right here, it's going to peel back here and then I got to do you know and then I got to clip that I got to deal with that and then it you know makes it go wonky this way here and back up around like this and down it'll just fall straight down so with that let's do one I hope this helps somebody Sorry, if you keep your saw in the wood, there's nothing wrong with that cut, right? Look, it's not cracked, it's not broken. Even if it was a logging show, that could go to the mill. There's no crack, there's no break. You don't have to cut off any wood, it's just a straight cut, right? Sometimes it turns out that way, sometimes it cracks a little bit. You know, in bigger wood with more weight, if I were to cut it way up there, it would probably break off and it would crack wood but like i said i'm cutting firewood so that don't really bother me let's cut another one fairly flat cut I hope you can see that flat cut flat cut going to the mill if you needed it to but it's just going to my house to cut cookies so we're good with it yeah like I said hopefully this helps you know it, it I know it helps me yeah get a little bit of scenery here It's a lot of weight hanging on that old root wad. That's another story dealing with root wads. Root wads put uh, put can put on different tensions. Even though it's barely touching the ground, it can either flop back in its hole or it can try to come at you back down the hill or sideways. You never know which way the roots are pulling it. This tree is set up firewood cutter's dream right here. Yeah, firewood cutter's dream. Off the ground like this. If I could get to this road right here, I'd just be cutting it off in blocks, throwing it in, throwing it in the truck. 
yeah, this is, uh, this is nice cotton here. We'll cut one more, maybe. I'm gonna cut one off. I'm gonna cut a long one off. Sorry about the moving around. I'm gonna cut a long one off. And we'll see what it does to the wood. That ain't gonna work. Kinda crooked. Yeah, I'll just cut this straight off. The sharp saw you can get away with it in the right wood we got lucky on that one but see it still broke wood right there a little tiny bit but it broke wood right there had I come up from the bottom and then rooped around come down from the top it wouldn't have done that right as you can see those over there flat cuts another thing about this is you don't want to you don't want to be here. You don't want to be here. Another reason for long bars is you want to be here. And roll up and around. And then down. That way you're further away from the tree if it pops or whatever and it comes, you, you don't have as much bar to pull back out of the wood. You know what I mean? As opposed to here. If I'm here, then I gotta go clear to here and then clear to there. Too much movement, too much action. Hope that makes sense. I hope any of this makes sense. Cut one more, maybe.
Nice load of wood. So now, this is just test logs for down at the Spirit Fire. Because all I got left is big wood. So yeah, anyway, thanks for joining me everybody. Appreciate it. Hope, uh, hope some of this video makes sense and helps somebody out. You know, for as far as different scenarios, saws getting pinched, those kinds of things, you know. Just trying to help, that's all. All the way around. All right, everybody. Take care, be safe. We love you all. Keep spreading kindness. Keep helping people out. Jazz man, it's rolling. See a little bit more of the mountains today. Keep your spirit high, let the chips fly. <laughs>